Hi, welcome to Super Speedy Color Theory with me, Emma Block. We're going to talk about how to create contrast in your work. One of the main ways to create contrast in your work is just by using different colors. Every color has an opposite color. When we use two colors that are opposite to each other, that creates contrast or hue, and they make each other look more vibrant, more bright. So, for example, green and red. What about other ways to create contrast in your work? tonal contrast so that's light areas and dark areas so if we stick with the green that I've got here we can make it lighter so it's the same color the color hasn't changed but it's lighter which creates tonal contrast a great way to think about this is if you imagine your painting in black and white would it still look good so another type of contrast is contrast of saturation this green is pretty vivid and bright to make it less bright. A clever way to do that is actually to add a little bit of the opposite color. So I'm adding red and I'm also adding white just to balance it out. So if we get the balance right with adding um, red to the green, we should eventually get gray, saturated and desaturated. The final way we're gonna look at adding contrast is contrast of temperature, warm and cool versions of the same color. So we're starting with this one, which has quite blue undertones anyway. We could add some blue to it and you can see how that makes it cooler. We could also add some yellow and you can see how that makes it warmer. These are quite subtle variations, but we can keep adding to make it more pronounced. So there we can see contrast of temperature. So we're kind of starting in the middle with the green and then this is getting warmer. So we're bringing in more yellow and this way is getting cooler, bringing in more blue. And again, it's just another way to create contrast in your work.